Okay, today we're going to go ahead and uh, <coughs> swap out a uh, electric meter to run a backup generator to a standard home electrical panel. All you really need is a screwdriver to do this. Takes about, well, doesn't take long at all. So, let's start right now. Let's say your power went out, or Katrina hit, or Sandy hit, or you need to go ahead and light up a house that's on a job site, your cottage, your hunting cabin, whatever. Um, what I'll do is just pull off the breaker panel, a couple screws. Pull the meter. And install the install the generator. Disconnect. Feed your common and your ground wires down through the box. Take your uh, ground wire and connect it to the ground bus, which will be connected directly to the, the box itself. This is all in the directions and instructions for installing this. White wires for common that'll go to the bus bar that's common to all the circuits in your house. The ground wire, the green wire, is just that. It goes to the chassis of the box. And this is something that uh, pretty much anybody can do. That's done. And we go ahead and put our panel back on. Take your cord supplied in the kit. You find a keyed lug on this. Plug that in. Give her a twist. It's on there now. And then take the other end and plug that into your generator. Fire it off. And once she's running, flip your main switch. 
and they have power to your house again. And that pretty much concludes that. That's how long it takes to go ahead and get power restored to your house after natural disaster or if you just want temporary power off a generator. And you could use all the breakers in your house as you normally would as if you had utility power. And this is available from Citywide Electric. Um, and uh, they can be reached at 1-858-504-0573. Yet again, it's Citywide Electric makes this device here. It's the simplest one I've ever seen. And that's about as long as it takes to install. So, yet again, it's 1-858-504-0573. Yeah.